clear the trail of her. She spoke with Les Trent. It's woman versus bison. I was way too close. Rebecca Clark was hiking in a Texas state park when she came upon a herd of bison. I'm going to try to see if I can make it by. Wish me luck. She waits for the majestic beast to pass and proceeds to engage in a friendly conversation. All right, guys, get going. Go over there to your babies so that I can get by. There you go. Keep going. Why didn't you just turn around? I just thought, well, I'd already passed up two miles ago, and then I came back through and I felt confident about it. At first, the bison appeared to ignore her. Thank you. I appreciate it. But as Rebecca gets closer, one bison turns and growls before charging her. She drops her phone as the beast pours her in the back, sending her right into a thorny bush. What did it feel like? It felt like a truck hitting you. He gored me. He hooked me with his horn, um, flipped me up, almost like kind of backwards, kind of flipped me up, and then projected me forward into a mesquite bush. With limited cell phone service to call 911, she sent this text to her 22-year-old son. I've been hit by buffalo. I'm serious. Please send help. I can't move. How were you rescued? I was taken by ambulance to the um, to a hospital, but it was not a trauma hospital. So then they had to care flat me to a trauma hospital. Rebecca spent six days in the hospital with a large gash on her back. You're lucky you weren't killed. You're absolutely right. You're absolutely right. And I have no injury to my organs. Um, it is strictly just a gash. <laughs> Wow, despite their size, bison are super fast. They can run three times faster than a human.